This is an open air honey bee hive. Very rare for us in the high fault here in South Africa. Through all our removals that we've completed uh, so far on our journey in beekeeping, um, we've never come across an open air hive quite like this one. Uh, when I was called to this property to come and look at these bees, I thought they had just landed in the tree um, and they were uh, sending scouts out to go and look for new location to build a new hive, um, but very quickly realized that uh, this is where they've settled. What we can see as we remove the bees is the beautiful comb that these ladies have built. Um, this comb shows us that this hive actually has been here for probably a season already. We know this from the color of the comb and um, you'll notice that the comb that's in the middle is much larger and slightly brown in color, whereas the comb on the outside is a lot lighter in color. But what I find really, really interesting is that our household winters can get to sub-zero temperatures. These bees are quite happy to establish their home in this tree exposed to the natural elements, the wind, the rain, and the fluctuations in temperatures. And this says to me that African honeybees are quite resilient to what nature can throw at them. And they're quite willing to build their homes in places where they are exposed to these elements. This particular swarm has established itself in a tree right next to the house where there's children, the children are playing around the tree. And so we do need to remove this swarm. And, um, we're going to relocate this uh, swarm to our apiary and we've taken the comb carefully out of the tree. We've placed their brood into a hive box and we will take every single bee that we can from this colony in the bee vac to the apiary and establish them in a, a safe environment where they can thrive. Thanks for watching this video and uh, really appreciate you hit the like button if you enjoyed it and please subscribe if you'd like to see more of our videos.